Okay, we got a head waist, 10 amp hour, 38, 120, or whatever they are, cells. Here's the multimeter hooked up to it. Multimeter took a little damage from the uh, LiPo tester, but it's still going. So, hooked to this is a battery charger that can deliver quite a lot of current. Okay, there we go. So, it's charging it, uh, you know, maybe 60 amps or so right now. And the voltage is at 4.9, looks like. Cell is pretty cool. Both ends are tight. So the cell, the end plates on the cell jump right to you. I don't know if the camera can see that, but it's, it's about uh, 11.5 volts there. Cell is fairly warm. Actually, it's getting pretty hot now. Cool. So I think it's as good a time as any for the surprise. So the surprise for the, uh, I don't know if you can see it, but got a uh, crossbow surprise here for that cell. Throwing my safety glasses for this one. Set this up back against there. Looks like I hit low with the crossbow. Damn it. So it pierced right in there. So we got an arrow stuck in the headway cell there. Looks like it broke the arrow. Just curious what the voltage is at. Is that uh, one point oh volts there? So it's, it's internally discharging pretty hard and boiling, which is kind of cool. Wonder if what the fumes it's boiling are. Uh, flammable and get something to light it. Yeah. 
Any of you guys flammable? Anybody? Anybody want to burn a little bit? Hey, alright. Got some going. Sweet. Move this. Look at that. Beautiful. I wonder if the voltage raises as the cell burns. Nope, appears to be kind of erratic. I'm going to disconnect my leads now because I like these leads. Oh, that's pretty cool. Not bad. Let's see what happens if I squeeze it in a vise. Okay, so there's a headway cell with an arrow in it, arrow head stuck in it, and about to get crushed to the face. Okay, flaming headway cell in a vise. Probably have some kind of face protection on it. Let's see what happens. Put a pretty good squeeze on her. Doesn't seem to mind a little crushing. If I can crush any more on that. That's about all I can crush. Hit it with an axe or something, though. Ten pound sledge. that arrow point right through her. Huh. Well, I'm gonna have to say headways are pretty safe. Wow, that copper's hot. Who would have thought you'd have something on fire for a while and it'd get hot? Well, there you have it. That's a headway cell that's been overcharged to uh, 19 volts and then shot with a crossbow and then lit on fire and then had the uh, arrow bolt tip pushed through it, driven through it. And Alright, I'd say headways are pretty damn safe.